Okay, folks, we're going to uh, look at these strong trending markets. Uh, there's a possibility that a major top has been made here in the market, and we will be watching it very closely. But as you notice here, this is the NASDAQ. You'll see we have the big drop. We come down within eight ticks of the uh, high in the NASDAQ uh, being the 382, and then it breaks. Of course, when you go below here, it's quite apparent, you know, that you're heading down and this was your first correction. And if you do the homework yourself, you'll see that the next little rally had was also a 382 uh, retracement. If we take a look here at the E-mini S&P, here was the high that was made back here at 47.45. Uh, we came down. There's the rally to the exact tick. 46.43 and a quarter was the high. And then from there, we've started to come down all over. In strong trending markets, you're going to see that. Notice here on the upside, there's a 382 to the downside. So that's that's what you're watching. Watch for these really strong trending markets, and they'll give you a chance to get in without risking too much. Another one that we looked at here was the gold. Look at the gold. Exactly 382 off of the high that we made back here to the tick. And we, we sent a video out ahead of time saying, watch for this A, B, C, D. In fact, we highlighted this was a beautiful head and shoulders pattern right here. There's your shoulder, head, shoulder, everything lined up with time. There was your uh, 382 retracement and boom, up it went and then down it went. So if you're looking at 15 minute charts, they're gonna give you a pretty good idea of how to enter without risking uh, you know too much. The next one we want to look at here, of course, here is the crude oil, another beautiful one you'll see here. We come down, look, we go right up to the 382, and look at this, folks. This thing dropped $10,000. I mean, that's a that's a huge, uh, huge break. So once they go through here with these wide-ranging bars, they don't take any prisoners, just like they did on the upside. So remind ourselves of that. Now, I wanted to highlight one other one on the crude oil, because in the middle of the day here, after that big move here, we came down, we rallied one more time, almost to the exact 382, but with a beautiful A, B, C, D pattern, just perfectly. And that took, uh, you'll see this took about five hours to complete. And then we went from 74 all the way down to 68. I'm basically, you know, in a cascading fashion, which is, uh, you know, very, very important. I'll include all of these uh, in the video here so that you can take a look at them. These are only some of them that we were looking at, but uh, they were certainly, uh, they were certainly there. I think I had one more to look at. No, that was a crude oil. So that was the, uh, extent of the ones I want to look at crude oil, the uh, S&P and the gold market too. And these are the big ones to watch. And the same thing happens on the upside, only reverse with the 382, but watch strong trending markets for that 382 to be, uh, uh, you know, hold up for as far as resistance or support. So that's what we're looking at. So live every day in an attitude of